Power Over Predators, a group that works to prevent child sex trafficking, held a forum for parents and children. Nine on your side's Greg Bradbury was there with some of the biggest takeaways parents need to know. I need to be engaged. I need to be in good conversations with my kids. And um, not, that I, not that I didn't know that. It's just the heightened awareness is really amped up. Scott Spader was one of the many parents that were at Push Ridge Academy learning from Lisa Hansen. His parents still feel ill-equipped and, and have lots of questions as to how they can safeguard their kids. So I'm just thankful that they showed up tonight because they, they walked away with some tangible steps that they can take. One of the biggest things parents can do is checking their kid's phone. Members of the Oro Valley Police Department were there as well to answer questions. We, we reiterate, you pay the bills. Pick up that phone, take a look, know what's going on in your kid's life, know who they're talking to, and uh, if you do find something suspicious, talk to them about it. Sergeant Amy Graham also says to know your kid's passwords. This will allow you to randomly check their accounts, but also helps them if something happens. But know those passwords in case something does happen uh, and uh, you can't find where they're at. You need to have access to everything that they have on social media, so know their password. They also recommend you download the FBI Child ID app in case your child goes missing. But the best prevention is a conversation. If you're loving on those kids and you're teaching them the truth, it helps them detect lies. And so that's just kind of how we all want our kids to be aware of, like, who's got something in mind that's not good for you, and I want to help teach you how to protect yourself from those scenarios. We'll have more resources for parents and children on our website, kgun9.com. Reporting in Oro Valley, Greg Bradbury, KGUN 9, on your side.